Hello my loves, what is up you guys? It is Cameron here, back with another video. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and turn those post notifications on so that you don't miss an upload. So guys, I am back with another sit down video and we have some tea to spill today. No, I'm just kidding. But I do wanna to talk to you guys today all about the Victoria's Secret Natural Body Care line. I'm just so excited to talk about this with you guys because I feel like I've talked about it here and there in like a vlog or whatnot, but I wanted to do a whole sit down video talking about these products because girl I have some things to say okay also I'm trying to find like a new cute filming setup in my room I'm currently in the process of reorganizing and kind of redecorating my room in a way so we've just been chilling in front of these closet doors with the handle in the background so ignore that but I do like the white background so we're just gonna go with that my hair is looking a little crazy but okay all right you guys so we are going to be talking about the natural body care line from Victoria's Secret really quick you guys this line is actually called the natural beauty line not the natural body care line it is natural body care obviously but I thought the line was called natural body care but I messed it up the entire video so these products I'm going to be talking about are the natural beauty line products from Victoria's Secret and I do want to start off by saying that I feel like this body care line is so underrated from Victoria's Secret products like I have hear people raving about Victoria's Secret products all the time but I don't hear a lot of people talking about the natural body care line and I just want to say that I have some amazing things to say about this line and I'm obsessed with it and I want to kind of just talk to you guys about everything that I have from the line so really quickly, I just want to tell you guys that I have three scents from this line. The pomegranate and lotus, the green pear and citrus, and now I have the lavender vanilla. And I want to kind of just talk to you guys about each of the products, which is the body scrub, the body wash, the body lotion, and the body mist, along with each of the scents as well. I have so much good things to tell you guys about these products, and hopefully this video will help any of you who have been considering buying these products, but I've been a little bit unsure about it. We're going to help you out, okay? We got a whole Victoria's Secret bag here with us because... I actually went there today and just picked up the lavender vanilla line, which I did not have before. And I wanted to tell you guys really quick that right now, and I'm gonna be posting this the day after I film it, so right now, the natural body care line is $12 each thing, which I did originally get in my other scents of this for cheaper than $12, but I was really nervous about this scent running out just because I know it's like kind of newish and I'm just nervous, I don't know, and I really needed it because if you know me, you know my obsession with lavender. I have everything lavender, lavender vanilla, lavender rose, regular lavender. I can definitely do a video soon if you guys wanted to see some of my favorite lavender products because if you've been following me for a while you know how obsessed I am with lavender but I did want to grab these while they were this price and I know that you can return stuff within 20 days at Victoria's Secret and I know that you can do a price exchange within seven days so if the price does drop within the next 20 days I could always bring it there and exchange it for the same product or return it and get the same product again for a cheaper price I did get the other ones for definitely a lot cheaper I typically do buy my Victoria's Secret body care products for under ten dollars usually like eight or nine is the max that I spend I've gotten products there for like four dollars before which is amazing so um, definitely spending $12 on one thing and then I think I spent 48 total on the four things That was not easy for me because I don't typically do that But I really really wanted to get my hands on this line I've been looking at it for so long and I just ugh, I just needed it Okay, but we're gonna talk about each of the products So I'm actually gonna start by talking about the body scrub So I have the pomegranate and lotus body scrub Which is the balance one and then I also now have the lavender vanilla one Which is a relaxed one and I don't have the body scrub for the green parent citrus because I did actually buy the other products from that um, to go with my tree hug parent chia seeds scrub so I don't have the actual scrub from Victoria's Secret which is totally fine I'm a little upset about it because the green parent citrus scent is no longer in stock I'm pretty sure they discontinued it and they replaced it for a cucumber and green tea one which I love the smell of that one I did smell it in the stores I did not purchase it but I will miss the green parent citrus one so I don't want to finish it because it's just so good I do kind of wish I got the body scrub because I don't think that this really matches that well with the tree hut one like it just doesn't really smell the same get into that a little bit more later we only have the lavender vanilla and pomegranate and lotus scrub as you guys can tell from this, I have definitely made a dent in this and I just want to talk about this body scrub because this body scrub is so underrated okay the Victoria's Secret body scrubs from the natural body care line are amazing you guys know I love my tree hut scrubs and I feel like I always compare body scrubs to those so I'll kind of compare it a little bit I feel like the tree hut scrubs definitely have a thicker exfoliating bead if that makes sense it's a thicker product it's a little bit different I feel like this feels more like a lotion with exfoliating beads in it and that feels more like a jelly like not jelly how do I kind of like a jelly like a jelly feel to it 
it with the exfoliating beads. They're definitely rougher exfoliating beads and they are more coarse, I feel like, but I think that they definitely give you a little bit of a deeper scrub than this one does, but that doesn't mean that this one doesn't give you a good scrub because this gives you such a good scrub. This will leave your skin feeling so soft. It will leave your skin feeling beautiful and glowy and will give you such a clean shave if you use it before shaving. And the pomegranate and lotus scent is beautiful. Like this is probably one of my favorite scents from Victoria's Secret, to be honest. And it's very, very sweet, but it's also just very mature and feminine and just beautiful. And I love the packaging of these scrubs as well. And they're just amazing. And something I love about these scrubs is that they're not your typical tree hut scrub where it's just a scrub. These actually get sudsy and they have a very nice lather. So not only do you feel like you're exfoliating your body, but you also feel like you are like cleaning it, which obviously still use your body wash with it. Use your bar soap, do what you got to do. This is not going to replace a body wash for you, but it is an amazing scrub and it'll definitely make you not only feel like smooth and glowy and exfoliated, but it will make you feel clean and that is amazing. And let me just tell you guys the lavender and vanilla smell. Well, we can't really open. I'm not going to open this right now. Okay. But the lavender vanilla smell from Victoria's Secret is beautiful. It is very similar to the Bath and Body Works lavender vanilla smell, but I feel like this one might be a little bit more subtle, I would say. Like... I just sprayed it in the cap. It is very similar and it is a very basic lavender vanilla scent, like I said, but it just is so subtle, but it's also so like, oh, uh, I don't even know. Like it just smells beautiful, like so, so beautiful. And I could smell this all day. Not going to lie. I kind of smell vanilla a little bit more than lavender, but it reminds me of if you were to mix like bare vanilla from Victoria's Secret with just like a lavender, I feel like that's like the exact thing they did here. And it smells beautiful. I'm going to talk more about the body spray after, but so yeah, these are the body scrubs. Definitely amazing. And I'm obsessed with them. So now we're going to move on to body wash. Again, we have the body wash in the three scents. We have the pomegranate and lotus, the green parent citrus, and lavender and vanilla. So I have definitely made a dent in both of these. And let me talk to you guys about these body washes. These are probably some of my favorite body washes I've ever used. First of all, a little bit goes a long way. So don't be discouraged by this small package and be like, I don't want to get it because it's so small because a little bit really goes a long way. The lather on these body washes are beautiful. The scent is long lasting you feel very very clean after and they're also super moisturizing which it says it's a moisturizing cream body wash with shea butter which you already know if it has shea butter in it it's probably gonna be good these literally make me feel so clean and it leaves my skin feeling so so smooth they're probably some of my favorite body washes to be completely honest and the smells are beautiful obviously i already told you guys about the scents with these two the green pear and citrus scent guys i smell citrus a little bit more than pear and i think that's why it doesn't really go that well with the pear and chia seed tree hut scrub and that's why I kind of wish I got the actual scrub that goes with this but it's okay I can't dwell on it but it's just beautiful obviously I don't if you can get your hands on this probably on like Mercari or eBay I would recommend it but I'm pretty sure they did discontinue it but I did smell as I said the new one which is the cucumber and green tea that one smells amazing as well I also smelled the coconut and rose one which also smells beautiful I would definitely like to pick that one up soon which as I always say I'm not a huge fan of coconut it can't be something with a super strong coconut smell but mixed with the rose it is so beautiful and such a warm scent i love it so much so all the scents from this line are amazing like i said body washes are phenomenal and the packaging guys like if you've noticed the packaging in all of these are just gorgeous we gotta talk about that too so we're gonna move on to the body lotions and i have some good things to say about these body lotions again i have all three scents and look at the packaging it's so so pretty like and with these body lotions you can actually see on it that it says 24 hour moisture which you don't see on your typical victoria's secret body lotion and i don't hear a lot of people talking about how much more moisturizing these are than the regular ones because i know that there are a lot of people who will say to me oh well cameron victoria's secret body washes are super watery they're not very moisturizing i get that and a lot of people say that they need to mix like a body oil in with it for it to be really moisturizing 100 percent get that um for me personally i i really like them they are a little bit watery but they do moisturize my skin. I don't have super, super dry skin also, but I know if you would, you'd want to mix body oil in. There are some days where I will mix body oil in with my Victoria's Secret ones. But if you find that Victoria's Secret body lotions are watery, I recommend trying the 24-hour moisture ones from this line. These actually have shea butter and coconut oil in them, so they're so moisturizing and it'll leave your skin smelling good and feeling so moisturized all day. And especially like the combination of all of these products, like you are going to smell like this scent all day long. So, 
I have definitely made a dent in this one like this one I've used so much because it's such a clean and refreshing scent also I didn't mention before that this one is refresh so they all have like a little thing underneath this one says refresh this one is relax and this one is balance so I think that these are just so so great and so yeah definitely get the ones from this line if you want a more moisturizing lotion from Victoria's Secret all right guys and then we have our fragrance mists here so these were pretty much the same as all of the Victoria's Secret fragrance mists I have the same three scents and these are just super pretty and sleek you got the gold cap they're just very clean looking they don't have like any type of like design on them and so with these as I said they work pretty much the same as the regular ones would and because we're layering all our products because we have an exfoliator a body wash a moisturizer and a body spray you're gonna smell like this all day long I'm telling you guys I literally will like drench myself in this it smells so good like all of them smell amazing and I literally just love these so much and they go so well like I love how you can have all of it you know but we do know that fragrance mist body mist body sprays they don't last as long as regular perfumes but like I said because you're layering all of the scents it's going to last so much longer also like putting it on right after putting the lotion on it'll really let it stick to your skin and I do think that these are amazing I really love Victoria's Secret fragrance mist because they just have the best scents ever that you won't find anywhere else like I mean Bath and Body Works also has amazing ones but you know I love them and I feel like they do last me a while certain scents but then there's other scents that don't like Amber Romance Moonlight Frost like those scents will last me all day long but then there's other scents that like might not but yeah I'm literally obsessed with the Victoria's Secret natural body care line as you guys can tell I'm raving about it and I think it's so underrated go get your hands on some of these products for real like I highly highly recommend it go to the store smell them smell which ones you like like the scrubs are just super super good like I can't even tell you guys this is probably my favorite body scrub after tree hut ones like I think I like these even better than the dove ones they leave your skin feeling so smooth so exfoliated but they're not super abrasive like tree hut so if tree hut does irritate your skin these are also really good but they're also not as sensitive as dove so I would say they're like kind of in between tree hut and dove but they also really clean your skin so I feel like I'm like honestly repeating myself but like I said I'm obsessed with this line you guys need to get your hands on these products and I really hope this video helped any of you who were maybe like debating whether or not buying these but do it girl do it okay um but I really hope that you guys did enjoy this video I hope it was super helpful for you guys let me know if you want me to do more review videos like this I totally can I love doing them I love talking about products I love and yeah thank you guys so so much for watching this video if you liked it make sure to give it a big thumbs up comment down below hit that subscribe button and I'll see you all in my next video bye guys